Hey everybody, the Bonga's back. Welcome to part 19 of Let's Play Mario Luigi Partners in Time, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Okay, right now we're instilling Koopa Dome, and now's the time to infiltrate it from the real inside. Well, the main area I'm talking about. I still don't understand what the Shrew Princess is trying to do, and, uh, or Shrew Princess Shrew, and... Apparently the babies like to have a good time. Oh yeah, we got you now. And some troops are dead. Come on, Luigi, you got this. No, you don't. Everyone's like, uh, okay. What's this? Oh, guess that's our next boss. Everyone's at a loss for words. <laughs> Maybe Luigi has a sweet tooth. Or sweet pelvis at this point. Sometimes I feel bad for Luigi, but he's just really meant to be comic relief in this game, or this series in general. It hasn't stopped in Bowser's Inside Story, that's for sure. And I don't think it's gonna stop in Dream Team, either. In any case, since I got that badge on Luigi, he does have a boost in speed. And he will be going first. So I think now's a good time to show off, say, the Pocket Chomps. What you have to do is just press the button of the Jumping Bro as he lands on the enemy. Also, that whenever the tail goes by, Press the baby button that's on the tail to do even more damage. Trust me, it gets harder to control this later. Got a female chump? It's usually a male chump I get. I don't know if it makes any difference. So this requires immense concentration. But it's so easy to botch later on. When you make a mistake with the babies in, I think the chomp gets faster. So now let's try the other one we got, trampolines. If we're lucky, we can make this guy dizzy. Now I have to pay attention to, like, what brother is coming down. Make a mistake, the trampoline's gone. It's faster, too. Man, I botched it on all four of them! I'm telling you, it gets harder! Oh, Luigi it is. And Mario! Yeah, at that point, there was actually two attacks. Don't pay attention to the color. Pay attention to the letter. That's what you gotta do to survive that attack. Now it's a male. I'm sure you guys can fill me in what difference does it make for a male chomp or a female chomp. Maybe the male chomp starts a little bit closer to the bro? I don't know. Oh, I botched it. And there we go. Some things just don't last forever, including this. Let's try another pocket chomp, shall we? Since we are doing a nice chunk of damage, and I think this guy is just less than a thousand HP. So that means this guy is practically close to death already. No, wait, I'm sorry. Defeat. Remember, it's the Mario universe. You gotta keep it clean. Tried to shelter death from everyone. Really, that's all it is. 
you know, just short coat death. They gotta learn sometime about death. It's a natural part of life. Oops. Watch that rather quickly. Wow, that was just awful. Okay, we're seeing some poison mushrooms and regular mushrooms. I think it's all for Mario. Oops. Don't hit that. Make sure you hit only the poison mushrooms and not the regular mushrooms. There's also going to be flowers coming your way too and you have to hit those. Otherwise you're just going to get burned. And Mario is sadly poisoned. I'm sure you can still play along. We'll use a refreshing herb later if the battle's still going. No, don't change! It was going so well! Oh. Yeah, I knew it. You need very good twitch reflexes for all this stuff. It's crazy sometimes. Let me get rid of this poison. Otherwise, it's just going to be a hassle. As long as Luigi doesn't get hit, he'll still do more damage. Oh, here we go. Mario's turn. There we go, we avoided damage altogether. Alright. I think we'll go with cannonballers this time. For a change. Got him! There. I knew he was close to being defeated, that's why I went with cannonballers. Good decision! And now Mario's at level 17! Fantastic! Uh, should it be HP? Probably. I think we'll go with defense? No. Speed? No. Stash. We're going with stash. Aww. Oh well. Can't always get what you want, I suppose. HP is looking good. Attack power. I'm gonna pass on attack power. Definitely not defense. Stash might look good for Luigi as well, but I'm gonna go with attack power. That was much better. You mad? Huh? You mad, Princess Shroop? Really? That's all you're gonna bring against me? Oh, we're outnumbered. Just jump on him, man! That's all you gotta do. And they just do nothing. Oh, oh no, they got hammers. Which sends us further down into Koopa Dome. What's this? Hmm. It looks like that shrub has something important to say. But what? A shop's here? Of all the places that have a shop? Well, at least Luigi's quite flexible. Do it! Do it! Yo! Oh, no. Don't try this at home, kids. Aw, don't get mad at him. It's like Luigi's like, No, I forgive you for giving me brain damage. He's like, I swear, they hit me! Oh, now you're making Luigi cry. Mario's like, what did I do to deserve this? This is just comic relief up the ass here. But that's what makes this game so awesome. Okay, now I know what needs to be done. I don't think I really need it too. There's a crack over here. Question is, can we do anything with it? Doesn't look like it, to be honest with ya. 
So for now, it looks like I'm just gonna have to leave it alone. Oh god, boos are here. I swore I jumped on it. Jumped on it, yeah. Dark boos from Thousand Year Door, alright. So let's see how this goes. Did I actually botch that? Oh, they go faster than regular boos. So I gotta get used to this new timing here. But I think it's gonna work. Remember, as long as Luigi does not get hit, he'll get a bonus in attack. Which is gonna be very good for us. And I trust Luigi to have that. I don't think it would make a difference for Mario for first strikes if he was the one who had it on. But I guess I can try it out if I get the chance. Or I can just be content with the status quo, because right now it's gonna win me battles here. And yeah, baby Mario goes to level 17. Fantastic. Stash? I think we're gonna go with Stash. Yes, yeah, six! That's just what I wanted. Okay, should I boost Stash for you as well? Probably not. Defense, no. Attack power? I think we're gonna go with attack power. Wow, that's the best that I could ask for. Actually, the best I could ask for is for attack of six, not four. Can I get the babies up here? No. Okay, there's a device over here in the middle as well. What does that do? In the meantime, why don't I just take out some more dark blues? You're gonna wish you were back in Pashi Sanctum by the time this is over! In case you're not one if you're wondering what I'm talking about, watch my Thousand Year Door Let's Play or somebody else's well, preferably mine, of course. And you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. You know, there's three of them. For some reason I was expecting a new enemy that time. What's with the hold up? I was worried that I might botch it there. Because remember, I'm more used to the original timing of the normal boos. Ooh, a trampoline. As opposed to the dark boos, which go fast. What if I went too early? Which can't happen. Getting some trampolines dropped in battle is going to be a very valuable asset, since I have a low amount of them. Alright, so... I wonder what the point of this switch is. I can get up there without Pro Ball, good. Oh, that's what it does. It doesn't look like it's on a timer, so it's not like I have to worry about separating. Oh, but I think I do have to be, like, adults here. Because this is going to be for a Pro Ball. Uh-oh, we're going to separate here. Yikes! Kylie? What the hell? Oh dear god. It's Penny! Hey, what's a big idea? Unhand me, you clods! Oh no, don't do this. Ace timing, fellas. We'll get up here and cut me loose, will ya? Are you sure that's what you really want? Bust me out or I'm a snack for sure! We're pals, ain't we? I gave you the dirt on the secret entrance, did I, didn't I? Now it's your turn to be good eggs, or it's curtains for me. Come on, hurry up! Well, what exactly can we do? Well, unfortunately, she got eaten by Pete Piranha, so how are we gonna get her out? In the meantime, we're just gonna have to look around. We'll get an ultra drop. I think this is the way we gotta go to get further. But I don't really want to do that yet. Instead, I want to keep exploring the other area. Besides, I still want to get to that shop. Don't even know why I brought them together to separate them again. Seemed like a colossal waste of time on my part. So why don't we head back, look around, 
see what we can find. Or maybe this was the only way we could go. Yeah, I think it was. No, wait! We could actually go left and then down. I haven't forgotten about that. What would it matter? Oh my god, there's five of them! This could be interesting! So why don't we use the, uh, should I use the bro flowers? You know what? I am gonna use the bro flowers. But the baby's gotta do it. One? Wow, what a slap in the face. Oh my god. Oh, that worked. Oh, one. I might as well show this battle since there's a hell of a lot of them. Oh, way too early. Oh, there's a pocket chomp! Oh, that is just bad. Do I get it back if I win? I really hope I do. I just gotta remember which one stole it. I think it was that one! Should've paid more attention. Ah, damn. I take a hit and I lose one of my items. Oh my god, what the hell is that? Looks like a sarcophagus. With boobs! No, wait, that's actually a Sniffit. Of course. Sniffero. Nice play on words. Kinda looks like an Egyptian dildo, if you ask me, or... Hopefully not a suppository. Oh, I get it now. Hopefully they're not gonna try to trick me with that. I was jumping too much and then I take a hit from the high one. Don't worry, I'll get used to those guys soon enough. I certainly wouldn't want that as a rectal thermometer, that's for sure. Oh, there's another Sniffaro defeated, and three more trampolines! No, wait, Dark Boo is of course, I mean to say. What I mean, Sniffaro, of course, but there was obviously a Dark Boo. Which I got a trampoline from, which is good. Those trampolines will definitely come in handy later on. Provided I get better at them, of course. Because, I mean, for some of these, uh, bros items, you practically have to have awesome twitch reflexes to work with them for maximum damage. It's gonna be very difficult to do. Almost impossible. I don't think it's impossible. Maybe if you had the ability to slow down time internally, it could work. Oh, but bombs are here. That's right, there was another hidden area. I forgot about. That involves the babies. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten about those guys and how they work. As you can tell, I practically did like four counters. Beautiful. Okay, this is new. I never thought I had to use the hammer that time. Well, I get that pocket chomp back that the dark boost stole. But I didn't think I had to deal with a counter like that. Dire free badge? Is that worth putting on? Let's see. Use as many attack items as you like when you have less than a quarter HP left? Hmm. For that to work, I would have to be brought down. But I sure, sure as hell don't want to do that. Um, let's see. Do I really want to put on something else for Baby Luigi? Probably no. So for now, why don't I just leave things the way they are? I don't think it's a big deal if I don't have the appropriate badge set up. Ah, it's just a game. Don't take it too personally, you know? Can I go here to the left? What happens if I do? I bet it takes me back to Blitzy Desert. It does! Okay, now I gotcha. 
In case I need to head back, I can return to this underground area. Perfect, so that's how I could have got up there. But I think those Dark Boos and Sniffaro will return. Will they? Surprisingly, no! I thought they would. But you know what? I'm not gonna complain. Instead, I'm just gonna do this. Get a bean. Get in the Pro Ball mode. Check out what's over here. No? Huh. Why did that not work? Oh yeah, I think I know why. There has to be a switch involved. Otherwise, you know, that little di diamond over there is not going to be out. Thus, keeping me from going over that way. I did see another area that has somewhere for the babies to go, so why don't I check that out first before I stop the video. It was over here. I'm gonna go check that out. Probably have more items. Oh, and no enemies to fight. So we get monies. We get two red peppers. That's very good. And two green peppers. That's okay. The red peppers are the best, of course. Like I said before. I'd rather boost my attack than boost my defense. And definitely boost attack or defense rather than speed. I don't really care much for speed. Anyways, I'm going to stop the video here, and in the next episode, we're going to continue exploring this underground area. Goodbye, everybody.